today is Friday, October 1st, 2021. Happy birthday today to Jared Hadley, Colin Shank, and Ashlyn Turner. The saint of the day today is St. Therese of Lisieux, also known as the Little Flower. Therese was a Carmelite nun whose service to a Roman Catholic order, although outwardly unremarkable, was later recognized for its exemplary spiritual accomplishments. She was named the Doctor of the Church by Pope John Paul II in 1997. She is a patron saint of missions and of florists. Investment Club will be meeting today at 10.05 in room 225. Come to learn about different types of investments and to join the stock market game if you have not done so already. Tim, have you joined the stock market game? I'm joining today at 10.05, baby! Let's go! All are welcome! Here is Homecoming King Gary with an announcement. Hi everybody, this is your new king. I want to let you all know that everything's going good amongst the lands of St. Thomas Aquinas. And because everything is so well, we're going to go ahead and take Monday off. Enjoy your three-day weekend. We love you, King <laughs> Gary. Saints, please consider signing up to help clean up the campus on Saturday, Saturday October 9th. 9th. We would love to see a lot of student participation on this project, and of course, there will be service hours available. You will be receiving the email soon with the sign-up link, so please reserve the date. Hey, Saints! Are you thinking about a career in engineering, science, or technology? Then the STEM Club is for you. This brand new club will focus on helping students attain practical and useful skills and knowledge. To accomplish this, we plan on having engaging competitions and projects, as well as insightful presentations and speakers. If you're interested and want to get added to the club group me, visit our table at today's club fair, or reach out to Nathan Hattrip at nhattrip23 at sdasaints.net. I personally have a lot of friends who would be interested in this club, including my close friend Claire, who is in fact a woman in STEM. Claire, if you're a woman in STEM, join the STEM club. Talk Check to Nathan Hattrip. Check out the Hattrup. table. Club oh. fair today. Seniors that missed the Balfour graduation announcement meeting on Wednesday during STA period in the theater can stop by the attendance office and pick up the materials that were handed out. Orders for graduation announcements are due Wednesday, October 6th. Come support your STA dance team. Dance team is having a fundraiser Monday, October 4th at Panera on West 119th Street in Olathe, Kansas. The fundraiser last, lasts all day Monday. Go out and show support for the girls. Show this poster when you pay. Saints, we have some exciting opportunities coming up for spring break. This year, we are able to bring back two spring break mission trips. The juniors and seniors are invited to spend the week at Jerusalem Farms. Jerusalem Farm is a Catholic intentional community located in Kansas City, Missouri. Built on the four cornerstones of prayer, community service, and simplicity, Jerusalem Farms strives to transform lives through service retreat experiences, sustainable living, and home repair. And the sophomores are invited to sign up for a mini mission. This will be a three-day, two-night service retreat held at the Franciscan Prayer House in Independence, Missouri. Each day will have a different service opportunity to serve your own community. If you're interested in either of these amazing adventures, see Mrs. Whalen at the campus ministry table during the club fair today. Hey, Saints! Just a heads up that our Purses to Persevere drive is the 18th to the 22nd. Purses to Persevere is a student-run nonprofit organization which seeks to inspire and empower women to persevere through the challenges in their lives by providing them with a beautiful bag filled with essential care items. The idea behind providing women with self-care items along with a handbag is that if you look good, you feel good. And if you feel good, you do good. Our goal is to inspire women to go out into their world and conquer their challenges, to promote good for themselves and those around them. Additionally, we hope to encourage self-growth and restore confidence that might have been lost in trying times. If you have any questions about the Purse Fear Drive, please talk to Izzy Earp. Teens for Life is also having a movie night at 6.30, 6:30 tonight. tonight. We are watching Horton Hears a Who. It is free for members and $5 for non-members. Bring a chair and Tim's snacks will be provided. <clears throat> Yum. <laughs> Saints Soccer came back from 0-2 to win 4-3 against Naperville North at the Great River Classic, Iowa, last night. Goals by Young, Muckerman, Hall, and Ryan. 7-1-1. Because Halloween is because October is the month of Halloween, or as we like to call it, Halloween! Halo is putting out a five-episode series called Ghost Boys. A new episode will air every Free Friday. Friday. So sit back, relax, and enjoy episode one of... Ghost Boys.
this thing on? All right, guys, I am here back at St. Thomas Aquinas High School because Luke called me and said there's some paranormal activity going on, but I have no idea where Luke is, so I'm gonna take measures into my own hands and figure this out for myself. I'm Mrs. Andrews and I teach math at Aquinas and something weird is happening. Not very long ago, I heard footsteps in the hall when I was working in my room and I thought, okay, maybe it's major, maybe it's a freshman. I'll just look out there and there was nothing there. So something is going on. Turns out math problems aren't the only ones I'm trying to solve around here. So I'm Patty Jordan and I'm the registrar here in the counseling office and there is really some goofy stuff going on here at this school. I don't know what it is, I don't know where it came from, I don't know how anybody can figure this out, but let me tell you, it's got to be figured out. We gotta figure this stuff out. Serena Price and I work in the spirit shop. And I put the vibe out, like I do not want spirits around me. In fact, I cover myself with the Holy Spirit every day and yet, stuff falls from the ceiling in the most odd and strange times. And I'm not the only one that's seen it. I'm Ms. Ogile, I teach English. I was up at school late one night and I was the only person here and I felt a tap on my shoulder and I know I was the only person in the building. So no cap, there's some freaky stuff going on at St. Thomas Aquinas. Charlie, we have talked to all of these teachers and I still cannot find Luke. He literally is the one that called me here and I, I have no idea where he is. My name's Craig Moss. I'm the principal at Aquinas here. I don't know what to do. I've got reports coming in everywhere from weird activity going on. And so like some of my teachers are saying that we've got ghosts and stuff. And I have searched the building. I've gone from the roof to the basement. I cannot find anything. I was even walking through the hall the other day and I see a guy walking toward me and um, he's trying to convince me he's a ghost. I saw right through it though. Um, so I've tried everything. I've, I've been from the north side to the south side. The only place I've not looked is the forest. That's where we have to check, we have to check the forest. After hearing from the St. Thomas Aquinas teachers, we decided to take it where no one has been before. We are here at the forest to see all the paranormal activity that has been going on here. What was that, what was that? Emo, Emo, Emo! Luke, you called me and I haven't been able to find you. Where have you been? No, Emo, you don't understand. The ghost called me to the forest. What do you mean the ghost called you to the forest? Watch this. Neener, neener, neener. Luke, what are you doing? <gasps> They're here. Wow, that was an absolute cinematic masterpiece. Emo, star of the show. Any any tips on episode two? What's gonna come next? Tim, you're gonna have to wait till next Friday when episode two comes out. No. Dang it! <laughs> <laughs> On the menu today is the Saints Cafe, bold pork, baked beans, and cheesy corn. Mm -mm -mm. That sounds so good. Oh Yummy. my gosh. Tim, now it is time for the fun fact of the day. Did you know that Levitating by Dua Lipa featuring Da Baby has over 125 million streams? What? That is my Friday song. Me too. I love that song. Thanks for watching Halo Morning Show. We'll be back with more for you next week. I'm Elizabeth. And I'm Tim. Signing, signing off. off. Remember, Remember, stay classy, safe, and, and create while you're here. here. Woo! We did it.